Hare Krishna, please accept our humble obeisances. My name is Sri Bhakti Das. We are here today with Ramachandra and we are in Bhaktivedanta Academy, Vedic Gurukul, Sri Mayapur. Krishna is non different from his holy name, serving the lotus feet of the holy name. That's the main purpose of this kind of music. So that's why we are trying to teach and spread this knowledge and we are trying to teach the boys this kind of instruments tambura, isra, sitar and we hope that soon we will be playing together with Ramachandra When we go to Sa, we play three times Sa, right? I mean three chikaris, yes Ramachandra? So then we repeat again, look One, two, three One, two, three, knee Okay? Yes, Clear? Now knee. Yes, very good. Nice. Good. The learning process of this music is very gradual and it can take many years. But for me it's very inspiring to see how the boys, they are very like um, enthusiastically practicing every day. And they are very like determined, and we can see that now some boys are playing very nice. And for me, it has been a beautiful experience to see that process. I remember when I started also, and and it was like that. It was very gradual, very slow. But every day you see that you are achieving a new step. You are giving a new step, and suddenly the instrument starts showing his own life because it is said also that these instruments, they are not like material objects, they are like alive, they are like spiritual paraphernalia. So slowly, slowly they start to manifest their real like sound and life, their, their soul. So that connection is very nice and you can see how the boys also experience that. Like they, they learn how to feel the instrument, how to connect with the instrument, and how to bring out the best of themselves and the best of their instruments. We have just to make da. So look, how do we know? No, this is ready, right? This is knee ready. Now da. Little bit high, you have to make it high. Music is a um, process of discovering yourself and discover your relationship with Krishna. How can you serve in a better way to Krishna and also to all living entities? Uh, you can help many people through music. When they are going through difficult moments, we see that music can give some uh, hope, relief. It's a shelter to overcome many obstacles in your life. It's about friendship, it's about forgiveness. You have to forgive yourself because of your lack of experience and knowledge, uh, your inability to play. And also it's about uh, forgiving your instrument when it's like too harsh with you. Uh, so it's a beautiful process and I'm very happy to see how the boys are discovering all these things through their instruments. That connection with Krishna and with others. In classes they develop like uh, friendship, like they are supporting each other. If one cannot not make the exercise, the other one will help him. So this is very inspiring, it's very nice. So I think that's the main goal, to create a very nice relationship among us and also to offer that, the fruit of that uh, process to Krishna. <laughs> 